All right, guys, Saturday, 2021 Worlds. It's about 5.30 a.m. We're heading over to Mikey's to get this final 10 pounds off for him to get his weigh in for the Rooster Black Bait, for the Rooster Black Weight World Championship title. Heading over right now. It's about an hour drive. Let's go. It looks wild, right? No, it doesn't. His face is not even skinny yet. What's up, guys? Hello, hello. Let's see what's here. Thank fucking God. You're cursing your mom? Oh, yeah. Fuck, skinny motherfucker. Oh, my God. Almost there. Oh, yeah. Easy. You're going to be there early. Last time I was 128, I was hallucinating, like, gone. Like, face drawn gone like looking around that's why i freaked out when i started the number 28 you know but i'm fine i feel like i'm like usually how i do at like 35. your face isn't even sucking at all man. no yeah. you look way bigger too. <laughs> too. i look bigger right now yeah and i'm not that really that skinny right now like uh face wise like i'm not dehydrated we'll fill in really well yeah you look fine this is awesome we just gotta fucking get three pounds easy if we do a good bath right like 10 12 minutes hot water then the, the blanket burrito were good, right? I think so, yeah. You should climb normal, but me, I do this 20 minutes non-stop without rest, just for cardio. Do you think because I'm normal or a normal person? No, no, just because you don't climb normally, yeah. it's going to make your body sore. It's like so jiu-jitsu. you go up on the rocks, you got to get down. No, I just keep jumping down, then going again. Jumping down, going again. But like, it's more endurance, yeah. you know? Uh, I have like seven weeks until I fight. So right now I'm on a phase where I'm just trying to get good cardio and just build endurance. You've been, you've been doing the rock climbing purely for, for conditioning? Just for endurance and just because it's so much fun. Yeah, it's like right. jujitsu because like the patterns and stuff, it's so much fun, like the puzzles. Does it help like uh, give you something else off the Yeah, mind up 100%. Yeah. That's why I love it. I love running and climbing. So you don't hiking right now because the heat's too Oh, yeah, I would die. Hiking I love, but it's just way too hot. I'm liking uh, anti-flag right now. Okay. I love like Vice against anti-flag, yeah, yeah, yeah. that music. <laughs> Depends what mood I'm in. Okay. What about Lady Gaga? That's when like, I'm in a different type of mood. <laughs> <laughs> and what I mean by 1% is you busted your ass and got to where you are through hard work. It's not because you're a this or that, it's because you took the time to break things down and you literally gave up so many things in life to be good at this one thing. So many things. And you know this better than anyone. And sometimes you suffer in certain departments like this because you haven't got the time to be social or yeah. uh, go to parties. It fucks you over so much. Listen, I've never tasted alcohol before. I'm 38 years old. Me neither. <laughs> well, there you go, look. I've never, I've never done drugs. I've never, I've never tasted alcohol. It's just, I, there were other things that I devoted my life to. I didn't go to parties and like, uh, I didn't really do stuff like that uh, because there were things that were more important to me at the time. And um, I mean, I wasn't nearly as successful as as, as, as you've been for, for like personal wise, but you can do anything. Now you know that you can do anything now. Would you cut out the last few days though to? Pizza, like two days ago. So no foods last? The last few days, no carbs. And that's when I died because like my whole diet is pure carbs. Right. So my body didn't know how to function without carbs. He hasn't done, broke the thing since you left. Yeah, dude, I'm fucking down like 20 pounds. I told you it's game changing. It's, yeah. it's fucking game changing. And then when you yeah. start doing pizza, you even lose more than pasta. Yeah, I was gonna ask you. Pasta you keeps me eat? heavier than pizza. I've been doing yeah, you Pizza made me zero more. fat on my body. Yeah, so I do just wow. literally just a pound, Thank you. Like two pounds of pasta at night. And you feel so good, right? Well, I've, 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 you have so much energy the next day. It's crazy, bro. Yeah, it's no, crazy. in pasta, you'll actually gain, you'll you'll be heavier than pizza. Well, dude, pasta <laughs> has a shitload of protein. It's, it's the healthiest thing. That's what I'm telling you. I know that. Yep, no I was knows. like looking at it, and I was like, oh, it has everything you need. And with the olive oil, it has a perfect amount of You'll probably feel better now, too. Yeah, it's fucking well, Clearer no, your mind. Well, the first week. No, you died probably. Fuck, shit, bro. Your body had to get used to it. Yeah, they were like, why are you doing this? I was like, I feel like terrible. I was like, I'm going to keep going. And then like the second, third week, and I was like, holy fuck. How are you having your pasta? Um, I just do it. I just boil it and then I just put the olive oil, salt. And Perfect, yeah, that's how I do it. Yeah, farm, yeah, that's it. 
Hundred percent. Yeah, dry. Now I'm like you, bro. I go to restaurants with these motherfuckers, and, and you're just I'm getting like, the clean shit. Yeah, I'm like, can I get just just pasta? And we'll tell you like you're crazy. What? Uh, I guess I got to figure out how to make that work. And you're like, just like, what the fuck, dude? It's so fucking it's hilarious. But, but yeah. it made you so much skinnier, right? Oh, way yeah. easier. Yep. Yeah, life just, is so much easier dieting. You don't just don't kill me, fuck. This is a Midwest water cut now, fuck. Hey, do you want George to get in the water with you? Yeah, that's what his lights go. Lightest belt ever, right? It's a good sturdy belt. <laughs> the gi and belt combo is two pounds total. Dang, that's good. That's why I have to be 25 exactly. <laughs> I just get angry when I take coffee. Just makes me like have rage. It makes me too jittery. Before you fight, that's my favorite start. Oh, yeah. Got his room good and ready now. Turn it to the steam. Come on, let's get down. Holy fuck. So not too crazy hot. Oh, yeah, I'll just sit here. Yeah, just don't have to first yeah. Dude, your sweat just, yeah. That's my yeah, favorite. this is perfect, guys. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Steam it, steam it, shit. That's way better. another level that was the best one i've done ever so listen when you're ever cutting okay and instead of drying off if you know you're gonna have to do another one you scrape okay why is that because when i scrape this off the pores still open and now it can still sweat oh it doesn't close the pores uh you want me to help you i have a card see Heath, your red belt this just a look just an old man <laughs> this is the best bath i've ever done like chain wise Chill wise, sweating wise. Oh my god! <laughs> wow, he's still sweating even yeah, though so he's taking it off. That, that, that's the difference. It really keeps your face so looks good. Your voice still sounds the same. I'm normal. <laughs> I feel fine. Almost there. Awesome. Almost there. I will say, Mikey's doing this for 21 years, and he has never had a coach ever do what you're doing yeah. for Thank him. You so much. Never had the support like Never this. had the support in five minutes. I, you know, and you know I'm a, like, a person that's into feelings. I, I, I can't believe the amount of support and just very, very thank you, yeah. really. Yeah, it's nothing. Really, unbelievable. Fresh my, tomatoes. My metabolism is so oh, I, I dump a shit ton of olive oil on it and a box of basil on top. 
I slice the tomatoes with the fresh mozzarella, the olive oil, and I eat that pizza. Then I eat a whole pint of acai this big, like the whole pint, because I have a sweet tooth, and that makes me gain no weight eating that as a sweet tooth, and it's better than ice cream. When you're doing this, no pasta. No pasta. Just pizza and acai. Dude, this is the lightest I've ever been. So how many calories? I have no idea. So what is this you're putting in your water? Ketamine? Had a light. Better for us to follow. Excuse me, follow so you don't have to come back. That's it. Sugar and Catalyte? Yeah. Alright, what do you guys think? Think you're the fucking champ. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got this. Don't lose this. Okay. You have you wanna put it in the bag here, Mikey? No, no, I'm sorry, I got it. You sure? All right. We'll be back All right, on. we'll be in touch. We'll be back. We'll see you. Right. We're gonna wait for them. Oh, relax. Oh my God. Big toe on the ground. If I thought I was on weight and then I'm not, I'd die. If you always go with the negative, you're never disappointed. <laughs> that's my mindset in life. I don't know if that's good. We might need to work on that. I think that's the Russian way. Darth Negatoni. <laughs> Darth Negatoni. <laughs> but my skill didn't register anything. So my skill said I was the same way as before bed. That's why I'm saying the scale was off today. Like it was heavier. Darth Positoni. Darth Positoni. <laughs> my blood type is B positive. So I'm supposed to be a positive person. What's up? Hey, how you doing? That's different again. <laughs> now it's up again. <laughs> Here, get off Can you zero it? Turn it off. It's going to be changing. Oh, it's not fun. One point two. There we go. My phone and my wallet was here now. Did Mikey grab it? But now we don't know the difference. I think you grabbed his stuff by accident. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Lose the wave. Lose the wave. One time. How much over? I gotta lose one. Point one? Just one pound. Oh, one pound. Hey guys, this is my last cut to 125. Um, as you guys can see, I'm still able to talk. I feel normal. Last time when I was doing this, I couldn't even talk, see, or hear. You know, I really died. Um, I feel like I'm cutting to 35, but maybe even better. Still normal. Um, I'm so excited to make weight and fight tomorrow. I'm good, you know, um, I really don't want to think about the number right now. Let's just pray that I'm on weight and then get hydrate, eat, and get ready for tomorrow. Hell yeah. You guys, congratulations. Play our song. Play so our song. Thank you, dude. I'm on weight. Uh, Play our tomorrow song. I fight. I'm just huh? maybe for weight. Play our song. You're listening. I just cut the 25. Oh. Oh, I'm no like 20, 20. I'm like 23 right now. Yeah, I'm 23 right now. Listen. Yeah, that's, that's what we listen to. Calm though, that's different. You gotta get ready for it. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are fucking awesome. <laughs> hey, we're ready for gang banging, baby. Is that George? No, he's in the back seat though. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I can't see you right now. Sorry, guys. You meant that Mexican guy that was standing out there? My bad. <laughs> he looked like he was walking into the car. 
I mean, yeah. you know George is in the back seat, though. <laughs> Fuck, dude, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, is that George? Does he need a ride? <laughs> <laughs> so good. Oh, shit. Guys, I'm on weight. Hell yeah. 100% now? Yeah. Mm. Nice. If you could get any car, like your dream car, for free. Tesla. That's what you bet? No charging. I mean, no gas money. So you prefer the Tesla to a Ferrari? Oh, uh, fuck. No. <laughs> Ferrari. You can say all that. <laughs> Italian cars for the win. Sure. Beautiful. 1.2 under. Take the picture. 1.2 under. Two days ago. He said, 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 you do, my dear. One point four under. Thank you. Where were you under? One point four. Yes. How are you feeling right now? I'm ready to fucking go. Let's do this shit. All right. Tomorrow morning, going for what? Your fourth world title. My fourth world title. All right. So now you got a whole day to go rehydrate. This is my ready? fourth division this year. Let's do it. All right, Mike. We'll see you tomorrow. Fuck you. How are you feeling? Good. All right. No problem. Thank you. Good. Okay. <laughs> Alright, dog, I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you so much, dude. 125 in the gi. Bro, you made that shit easy. Dude, I was 123 without the gi. Crazy. Closer to what? Dude, 123 without the gi. So I was 1.4 under, 1.5 under. You want her back? Yeah, it took too much. Yeah, that's all good. Fuck, this skill was first oh. off, so I had to come back. Rock, rock, Then I lost too much weight. Uh, you do you go to sauna? Yeah, I just did a quick bath. You, you got everything you need, water, yeah, all that yeah, stuff. Yeah, I have it. All right. Okay. Alright buddy, see you at tomorrow. Yeah, but yeah, 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 we'll join the morning? Yeah, no. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get it done. Best uh, experience. That's the secret. I'll win all the caffeine drinking contests. It's going to be 10 times better than the pasta you're eating. Let's do it. And the olive oil, once you start getting the better pasta dishes, I'm going to give you the recipes. You're going to do the, the pizza and like half a pound of pasta every night. And you're gonna be fucking light as hell. Dude, it's the secret. I made 25 this time, easy as fuck to eating pizza and I'll say every day. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, here's this. You want my elbow? Yes. You want, it's so can you get him a wheel It's such care, good quality olive oil <laughs> that they don't even change the pH levels in it. That's perfect. That? All right. Okay. Can I let me put this? Yeah, he can have that. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah, no. yeah, yeah. What do you mean? The oil, I need a lot of. He had a goldfish. Get the oil. Yeah, you know, can I just put it on my table? Or does it have to be in the refrigerator? Perfect. Good. Good. All right, guys. Final day of the 2021 Munjals, the World Championships in the Gi here in Anaheim at the Convention Center. We have Tammy in the finals already this evening. She had her matches yesterday. The women's go to the finals. Mikey has three matches today. Three matches. So the first match he's got Bebeto. He's the current, he just won the No Gi Black Belt World Championship title. So that's going to be the first trip. Uh, the second match is going to be either Jonas Andrade or Passport from Japan, both incredibly tough guys, and in the finals, uh, probably looking at uh, Bruno Malfacine uh, in the finals on the other side. So, huge day. Get in there, get this first match out of the way, get going.
Um, I lived my whole life with the goal of accomplishing titles, mm -hmm. and then when you accomplish the titles, you feel nothing. Yeah. And then it's like such a downer, you know, because like you get like this mindset where like you think, okay, if I win this, I'll be happy, you know, but uh, some an item doesn't make you happy. Nothing makes you happy. Happiness comes from inside, you know. So then once you learn that titles don't matter, you learn that what you enjoy in Jiu-Jitsu isn't the titles, aren't the titles, it's the process. So Working toward a goal is what I enjoy. Make the adjustments, Mikey. Good. Good. You got it. You got it. Good. Keep going, Mikey. He's going to tap. Keep going, Mikey. Yes. Whoa. You can't just eat that ankle lock, my guy. That's not how that works. That is not how that works, my friend. It just breaks the whole leg. Well done, Mikey. Hey. Awesome work, man. Awesome work. You just have to get the first fight out of the way. 
he's very like after that fight because I was so shaky when I started. Like, what the fuck? Yeah. And then like this after. Yeah. yeah. This gear a little better, right? Because I think it was too long. So when I was trying to circle, I felt like I couldn't circle. This is better now. Way better. It's shorter. Before it was like this, so it was like I was like this. Everything that you've been thinking multiple six thousand times in your head every day, like you do, yeah. it literally just happened that way. Okay, it did. It did. Yeah, like the, when you wanted it to happen, it yeah. happened. And when you came up, I had time to like move and like. So you go. You saw me do that. I was so relieved. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, guys. First match down for Mikey. Everything perfectly as planned. Three minutes into the match, he won by straight ankle lock on Bebeto. It was killer. Literally, game plan went exactly by the second as planned. So one down. Next, uh, going to be Jonas Andrade took out uh, Passport in a uh, penalty call in the last 10 seconds. So Jonas Andrade here in the semifinals. And uh, yeah, that's it. So uh, one down, two to go. I keep you yeah. appreciate yeah. you guys? Hell yeah. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Of course. Appreciate it. Hey, good luck today. You're going to get that black belt champion. I know it. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I really sacrificed everything I could to like be successful, you know? But like, I did it for the wrong reasons, you know? I really like thought it would make me happy. Like, I thought it would fill a void inside of me, you know? And I tried filling the void with a title. And what you learn is it doesn't fill a void at all. It just makes you feel more empty because you see that the title doesn't give you any doesn't mean shit. So then you learn as you get older, like filling the void isn't from any activity or anything. It's from self-fulfillment, like helping people and having Friends. a purpose, yeah. you know, because a title, what is a title? Just a past event. And next year, someone else will win it. Then the next year, someone else will win it. It's just an, like literally an object that yeah. you could buy in the store. Yeah. Bro. 
And on mat number one, advancing to the rooster weight final, representing Pedigo Submission Fighting, Michael Musabeski Jr. Yeah. Yeah. Let's fucking get this done. Get this done. But I have to relax a little, then we'll get like a good warm up in. God guard shit done. Let's have people like exercising and shit out there for like an hour. We're gonna finish them too. We're get all finished. So we're uh, back in the back uh, room. Two matches left for uh, before Mikey comes out for the Black Belt Rooster. Adult World Championships. Uh, like I said, this would be our first Black Belt World title. So uh, for me as a coach uh, and PSF as a team, so it's really, really exciting. Uh, uh, yeah, so a lot of work went into it. Mikey busted his ass and it's, uh, uh, you know, it's a great match. It's against uh, Bruno Malfacini, he's a 10 time Black Belt World Champion. So, uh, uh, you know, uh, Pressure wise, you couldn't get much better than this, man. This is uh, everything you can ask for as a coach and, uh, you know, and an athlete. So, uh, a couple matches and we're up. So, like, I'm just grateful for, like, everything. And um, I know that, like, I'm still going through my shit. You know, I have so much to learn, you know, but uh, I feel like I'm on the right path. <laughs> And now, on mat number two, the adult male black belt boosterweight final, representing Alliance, Bruno Alfacine. <laughs> representing Pedigo, sufficient fighting, Michael Yusufessi Jr. Let's go, Matthew, let's go! Uh, for like the super stressful situations, like world's finals, yeah. like I could like pull out like crazy things just because of those trainings I did, yeah. but like I hated it, you know. You said you wanted to quit the so many times. What made you not? My dream of winning worlds, you know. Fast feet, fast feet. Lead back, lead back, lead back. Nice, Mikey, nice. Good, good retention, good retention, good retention. That's it, that's it, that's it. We're down, down in advantage here, Mikey, down in advantage. That's it, that's it, that's it. Stay tight, stay tight, stay tight. Good, that's it, that's it, that's it. Nice, buddy, nice. Stay tight, stay tight. Be smart here, be smart. Good, good, good. No points yet. You got the points, Mike, you got the points. Be smart here, be smart. Yeah, I don't know. Hey Mikey, focus, focus. This is your position, focus. That was fucking crazy. <laughs> Two minutes down, Mikey. Two minutes down. We're up 2 0. Bruno has two advantages. Stay tight, be smart here. Good, good grip fighting, good grip fighting. Good hip placement.
Good. Be smart with your feet. That's it. That's it. That's it. Hey, let's go. Hey. Good again. 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 Go after Mikey, go, go, go. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Good, that's it, tighten it up, tighten it up. Tight, 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 tight. Yeah. Hey, let's go now, let's go. Making this count. Making this, tighten it up, tighten it up. This is it, Mikey, this is it. Hey! Let's go. Got a score here, got a score here. Hey, let's go. Got a score, got a score. Let's go, let's go. Heads on the yellow, Mikey. Heads on the yellow. All right, let's go back to the middle. This is it. Hey, we're finishing here, Mikey. We're finishing here, Mikey. You're finishing. Five minutes, 45 seconds. Tight, tight, tight. This is it, this is it. Hey, retake that back, Mikey. Be smart here. Stay tight. Keep your chest tight. We're gonna pull him back in, pull him back in. We're at five minutes, halfway, exactly halfway right now. We're up six zero here. Good, good gifts here, Mikey. Good gifts. Out of boy, out of boy. All the way, all the way around. That's it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Perfect, Mikey, perfect. Keep feeding that grip, keep feeding that grip. Is he considered back? Keep that grip, Mikey, keep that left grip. Hey, we're gonna score again off that, we're gonna score again off that. Four minutes left, Mikey. Four minutes left. Relax, Mikey. Relax. Keep the grips tight. Keep the grips tight. He's got to move here. He's got to move here. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to retake the back of Flower Street. Retake the back of Flower Street here. Perfect position. Three minutes, 20 seconds. You're going to force the movement here. You're going to force the movement. Here it comes. Good, good grips, good grips. <laughs> Thank you.
Two minutes, 59 seconds, Mikey. Two minutes, 59 seconds. Six, zero, six, zero. Two minutes, 29 seconds, Mike. Two minutes, 29 seconds. Mikey, Mikey, that's the second stall call. It's, it's for the body triangle. It's for the body triangle. You have one minute, 59 seconds left here. One minute, 59 seconds. All right, good here. We're restarting now. We're restarting. Watch the lapel. It's coming behind the head. Nice, nice. Get the grips. Perfect. That's it, baby. That's it. Mikey, undo that body triangle. One minute, 29 seconds. Keep the posture broken. One minute, 15 seconds. Fifty-nine seconds, Mikey. Go after it. Forty-five seconds here, Mikey. Forty-five seconds. He's got to move. The guards don't need to move. Right, here it comes, here it comes. 29 seconds, Mikey, 29 seconds. That might be why you're No, fuck no, bro. I there's a toll, there's a toll. Nine seconds, Mike. Five seconds, Mike. Five seconds. Three, two, hey! Hey! And your 2021 male rooster weight champion representing Pedago Submission Fighting, Michael Musum Messi Jr. In second place. Representing Alianze, Bruno Malvasine. And in first place, your 2021 male rooster weight champion, representing Pedigo Submission Fighting, Michael Yusufisi Jr. Yeah, that was, I, I was, I'll go past that test, Mikey. Yeah. <laughs> American Jiu Jitsu. Congrats, brother. Please. Oh, hey. That was the hardest part. I keep that up. <laughs> Last time, three, four hours. The guy came out. <laughs> so that was the that was it mikey won psf the first black belt world championship title man it's uh there's really something being out there you you think with uh when dante won in the chair dante won the nogi 
the Nogi World Championships at Black Belt and being out there in the chair. And Andrew won the, the Nogi Pans. You know, you, you always kind of wonder if you're ever going to get that, that feeling back, man. But uh, man, when Mikey was out there going against Bruno, the guy's a 10 time, 10 times Black Belt Gi World Champion. And there, there, there's just a difference in, in the IBGGF stuff, uh, not, not in skill level, man, but just, you know, uh, being a kid growing up, just w winning the Black Belt a Gi title was just always really something, man. And it's, uh, you know, it was always a dream for us to have something like that on the team. And uh, we did it, you know, uh, Mikey won. Everything that we planned worked exactly the way. I, it, it literally couldn't have went any more. The ankle locks as planned getting on, on Bruno's back. Uh, you know, we broke down every single person and, and how the, the, the games would play out. And I, I, I couldn't be more happy as a, a coach or more proud of Mikey and the team with, with how it went. And, uh, you know, after it happened, you know, usually with goals, immediately the second that he won, I just thought to myself, I want more and I want to do more. We can do more as a team. And I know even more now that this is just the beginning of us completely taking everything over and uh, that's what I'm looking forward to next.